If you've ever planted a seed, you'll know it takes time to grow into a strong and healthy plant. It takes even longer for people to grow their way out of poverty. That's why Cafford has been working in El Salvador for more than 40 years. We were there during the long civil war supporting thousands of people who had lost loved ones, homes and jobs. Acting for you, we have continued to work with the poorest people as they grow a future free from extreme poverty. We first met Jacqueline when she was two. Life wasn't easy. Her family barely had enough to get by. It was too expensive to buy the seeds they needed each year. So over time, Cafford's partner trained Jacqueline's dad, Fidel, to grow his own. The community also learned new farming methods and set up silos to store their harvest. Eight years later, Jacqueline's family still have to work very hard, but now they are happy that they have what they need. After the war, people who had lost everything had terrible memories of what had happened and little help to rebuild their lives. Gangs multiplied as some people saw them as a quick way to escape poverty. Cafford Partners set up safe spaces away from the gangs where young people could learn skills to help them now and in the future. Isabel joined one of these clubs seven years ago. It has kept her safe. She became a leader and uses her skills to help younger children also stay safe. Children like Diego, who saw a gang shooting when he was only eight. Now, aged 11, when he's not drumming, Diego loves drawing and is glad to be part of a project that is trying to grow peace in his area. Isabel is now 17 and hoping for a brighter future by studying science at university. In projects around El Salvador, Cafford and our partners stick with communities for as long as it takes them to find their way out of poverty. Another way is to set up small businesses through support and training. Ankula now proudly sells her own chicken's eggs. Lazaro's family paint traditional objects that Cafford sells in the UK. Edelmira's family now produce enough food to eat and hope soon to be able to sell their produce. Across El Salvador, people are sharing the skills they have learned and communities are growing their way out of poverty. But with 1 in 10 people in the world living in extreme poverty, there's still so much more to do. By brightening up with Cafford, you can help more communities around the world to build a brighter, more sustainable future for themselves. However you raise money, make, make it, it bright. bright.